everybody, it's Steam the Cops of the Search Authority, and today we're talking Tweeple Search. That is T W E E P L E S E A R C H dot com. And what are we doing? I'm getting tired of saying dot com, but hey, it works. So here we go. It's a Twitter search tool. So let's play games. I love playing games. So we're going to just go up here. We're going to type in the word Java, and we're going to look for developers. So, oh my lord, look at that. Look at all those Java developers that just came. And there's 314 pages and about 25, 30 on a page. You tell me how many of it. And look at it. And we get direct access to them. We get how many followers they have, how many tweets, list count, all that good stuff, how long they signed up. We can export the entire list to a CSV. And here's what's really funny. Um, their followers? Well, you know, if you're a job developer, who do you think is following you? More job developers. And we have filters. We can go by pro Twitter profiles or bios, influencers, hashtags, URLs, and there's more. We can actually do it by name, location, by almost anything. So let's pick a location. So let's pick USA and see what happens. Now, USA will get us some. We're probably going to have to do states. We're going to have to do a lot of different. But here are the child developers within the good old US of A. Let's see. We've got six pages, about 30. So that's 180. Of course, I'm betting money. I'm guaranteeing you that if I take the USA out and I put instead Seattle, which is where I go, let's try this again. Child developers, Seattle. Bada bum bum bum. Let's see what we get. And the circle, the green circle of thinking. I mean, there are a lot of people on Twitter, so I can understand why this might take a little bit. So, and Seattle may not be the right term. Maybe I need to put in Washington State or Seattle slash Washington or who knows. But we're going to find out here hopefully soon, because if not, then I'm just going to go ahead and figure out what I got. So why it's doing that, we can do URL, uh, minimum, max followers, max tweets. We can do languages. We can do all sorts of neat stuff. So let's see. It's still thinking, and I'm guessing because there are a lot of them. And or it doesn't, just doesn't like Seattle. It could take a while. Now, I may stop it because it is taking a while. That doesn't mean it's not working. It just means it's taking a while. And what I might do is try doing going about it from a little different perspective. Um, yeah, this is taking longer than I would like. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and refresh the screen. Uh, looks like you've, oh, I reached my daily limit. So it says, let's see. If, yeah, I've reached my daily limit. I need to sign up for free to get more access. I'm not doing that right now, but I will. But I would. But you get the idea how the tool works. Um, as a matter of fact, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just um, free sign up, uh, log in and register with Twitter. I'll just do my Twitter because it's pretty much easier. And here we go. Now let's try it again. So we got more filters. And that could have been why it was taking so long because I maxed out my allotted day thing for the day. So let's do Java developer again. Now let's see what happens and see if it takes as long or if it was just because I met my limit nope there we go i met my limit look at this so now we know these people are in seattle and that and there's only one page and then that's okay seattle may not be the right way to do it uh maybe i should have just said washington let's see what happens if we just put in washington washington and try it again now this is a freemium you get so much a day for free and then you need to buy and now we got from washington and di different washington obviously we get dc and washington usa but we get more people another way to go about doing it is just plain old usa another way might be just to pick the right language and figuring the odds are most of them are going to be not all in america but a lot of them are going to be in america well i guess i was wrong about that so much for that idea um, so let's not choose language. I think going USA might be the safest way to go here and then just going from there. But the point I, I guess I'm driving at for all this is look how simple this was to find them. And mind you, I'm searching based on Twitter profiles, hashtags. I could have gone by Twitter bios. Let's see if that gives us different uh, results. Uh, yeah, actually gave us more. So that's cool. So bios is a good thing. But there you go. Long story short. Quick, simple, easy peasy. Uh, let's go to the U.S. of A, since that seems to be the way they like to put the United States, U.S.A. U.S.A., U.S.A. Um, and just get them all now. Now watch, I've reached my limit this way too. But it happens, whatever. Um, FYI, if you're doing it based on your IP address, if you go ahead and use a VPN, you can change your IP address. You could probably use this indefinitely. I'm never gonna know you can. We're going to stop it because I'm 99% sure that it's going to tell me I reached my limit. 
and that's okay. So long story short, this is Tweeple Search, a good, simple, and easy way to find people on Twitter. And I'm going to just see what happened here. Go try this one more time. Yeah, there we go. Um, so there we go. That's it. Simple, easy. And the best part I like is you can download this as a CSV. That's really cool. That is really cool. So there you go. My uh, This is Tweeple Search, the Twitter search uh, tool. My name is Dean DeCosta of Search Authority. May the source be with you.